Hey everyone, my name is Sabrina and today's topic is what is the one thing you wish girls did more often in bed? So ladies, listen up and please don't forget to hit subscribe. Thank you so much. So let's get started with the first one here. This gentleman has said he wants feedback. Let me know if what I'm doing is working. Not everything is going to work, so. I'd much rather you tell me something isn't good, switch to what is good, and watch you love it. You turned on turns me on. Hey, well that makes sense. Good advice. All right, this gentleman says, don't wait until late at night to decide you want to hook up, especially on a weeknight where I'm getting up at 5 a.m. to head to work. If you wait until I'm dead freaking tired, yeah, I'm going to be tired and possibly uninterested. But really, are you guys ever uninterested? So this guy says, the biggest issue I have with, let's say, about half of the girls I've been with, not a lot, but enough to create a statistic, unless you sit them down and say, okay, what do you like? They won't tell you. Hmm, I don't know if that's exactly true, but you can be the greatest person in bed on this planet and never make a girl satisfied if she doesn't let you know what she likes. Every girl's different, so what gets them off can be a full 180 from the last girl or even a 180 from the last time you guys hooked up. So tell people what's good. Also, if you just starfish out and don't work with your man, then he is not the problem. Move a little. Sad man can. He says, not to steal all the blankets while elbow me in the ribs would be nice. <laughs> I think that happens a lot. It's definitely happened to me. She says she was asleep when she did it. Sometimes I don't believe her. <laughs> Pitmosh says, give compliments if I did good. You have no idea how much it helps on the self-esteem. You know what? I can agree with that. Okay, here we go. A few more here. What is the one thing you wish girls did more often in bed? This guy says, not talk about what the kids did at school today or how much laundry there is to do while we are getting it on. Yeah, that would definitely kill the mood, right? This guy says, not to radiate heat levels that match the sun when I'm trying to sleep. Usually it's the other way around. Usually you guys are the ones that are all hot and heated and sweaty. <laughs> Okay, the last few here. <laughs> this guy says, the amount of times she's in her sleep has kicked me or kneed me in the balls is beyond the point of forgiveness. <laughs> Ooh, that would suck. Uh, initiate it. We are almost always ready to go. No kidding. You should assume that if, we, if you want it and it's available, not wait on us to always get things started. Okay, good advice. And the last one is, oh, hug me instead of the other way around. Every night my wife gets grumpy if I don't spoon her when we're falling asleep. I just want to lay on my side and feel warmth for once. Well, there you go. Lots of different views there. Lots of different things that us ladies can take and consider. Um, so that's it for today. And please, again, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much.